Hello people, today we shall learn about the how we can install the Pega review component from the Pega marketplace. So what is the useful of this, you know, uh, this Pega uh, peer review? So it's like a real time environment so that, you know, you can install the Pega review component uh, into your personal edition and you can work it like a real time scenario. So usually in the real time scenario, so first of all, if we uh, get any sort of, you know, ticket on the uh, any sort of rule first we will be developing in our branch and then we'll be sending that uh, to the for the code review so in order to make it some replicate with that uh, you know real-time scenario so i am just uh, right now navigating you into that pega review component uh, uh, how we can download and how we can uh, you know upload it to our dev studio so let's check it out how we can do so I will be providing this link. So this is e uh, one of the uh, you know marketplaces we have in the uh, Pega community. So I will be providing this link into our uh, you know bio as well. So so after clicking this link, right? So now you will be navigating to these our available versions. Okay. So right now there is a available new available version is of uh, 8.6 or uh, 8.6.8. So let's download this. And if you want to get, you know, how you can download and you know how it will work, right? So you will, uh, I will also uh, provide this link as well so that you can have this, uh, you know, clear cut information about all these things. Okay. So let's check it back. So this is the download uh, latest version. So up to now, it should download. So let's once again click on this. Yes. So it is getting downloading. yes perfect now we got downloaded this pega review component let's navigate into this pega dev studio in order to have this thing yes so in order to uh you know uh, i can say yeah so now uh, we will be uh, uh you can say go to this distribution and go to this import And let's import from this is for local file yeah so this is the importing file and next click on next yes and you can click on next and let's check and you can click on next and it's saving back to the db so whatever the source file be providing right so it's yes it's completed and the click on next so it's importing right now uh, into this uh, you know database so whatever the source file be providing right so it's storing into the database so let's check over here now we can uh you know trace the uh yeah so it's completing right now it's moving so totals uh you know total records we have 3152 and uh yeah it takes some time now let's wait for a couple of minutes Yeah, no, right now it's having you know 100% let's check now everything has been in our records mode 3152 out of 3152 now let's now next you know click on the next so these are the two instances which has been you know successfully migrated to this application so let's click on the done 
so now as soon as you know click on the done right now uh, just uh, we need to uh, you know go to this application definition and uh, let's add the component so over here now we will be having the section called uh, enable components now just what we need to do means just we need to add this component okay so right now we don't have any sort of if we just keep on you know if we just refresh right so we don't have any sort of i know peer review component over here so in order to get this peer review component after this branch right so first we need to add this component which we have migrated yeah uh, which we have downloaded so let's add this click on the manage component and uh, yeah so over here now automatically it is having that status enable just click on that and click on okay yes so automatically it has been uh, you know added so uh, you know uh, many of the versions if this uh, you know this layout has been uh, you know has in this uh, you know has in uh, you know got like this right so you can anyhow so however it is a auto complete right you know you can uh, click this down arrow okay like this also you can do and you can select the version as well all right yeah now it's good to go now we can save so as soon as you just save right now come to this app explorer and uh, let's refresh this thing now see here we have successfully added this review so like this you can uh, easily uh, you can work uh, like you know like a real time uh, scenarios as well so as soon as you get this review right so first uh, we are not getting over here a another uh, button called review right so in order to get that review button so first we need to go to this branches and later on uh, here i have just added a branch all right so in that branch i have created an uh, you know activity rule so uh, i just want to make this activity uh, rule to be reviewed by uh, by my uh, you know uh, some other operator right? all right so let's uh, uh, add this uh, you know this review button so let's click on this code with r and later on we will be having this branch right so this is day underscore cwr is one of the branches we have right now just to click on this that's it so whatever the rules uh, we have created under this branches right so everything we will be available in the content so right now there are no review part over here right so let's create this review let's add something called you know uh, review and the due date just we need to make it as you know some some seventh or whatever it may be and later on uh, i have just created an another user id okay so you can't uh, you know able to provide your own email at uh, you know user id right so that's why i have created an another uh, poc one at uh, you know cwr.com so so to this uh, this uh, particular rule will be triggered to that review just i will click the center and i will create now as soon as you click on this create button right so now a new review button will be added so let's go back to this test activity and let's refresh yes we got this review now after completion of this uh, you know coding and everything configurations <clears throat> now we need to send this uh, activity rule to our uh, you know another operator id all right so to do that one so first what we need to do just to click on this review all right so yeah so over here so whatever the comments uh, you know they have posted and everything right so we will be getting over here okay so right now there are uh, no comments right so <clears throat> i will navigate into that other operator right so let's go back to here right now what i will do means i will just close everything and i will refresh this all right now i am getting this review over here now what else see here uh, in this review now see here in this drop down i got this d uh, day one rescue cwr and i just uh, you know uh, selected this thing and over here now i have added this test right so let's click on this test now 
perfect now we got this review or uh, to this as well now what i can do is just i have this button called down arrow right so over here now uh, i can make it as to do or ask or you know fix or whatever it may be okay so let's uh, what else uh, what uh, i can do it's uh, just to make it as a to do now this has been converted to do right now what else uh, i can do means i just create a comment over here yeah, perfect now what else i can do means mm, make the or make the uh, you know changes and then make the changes that's it now okay and i will post this so as soon as i just uh, you know post like this right now i will switch back to this main operator id and i will refresh this thing so as soon as i get uh, you know this refreshed right now i will be getting that post so whatever the other operator id has been posted right now those comments will be reflected over here so with this what uh, what happened means so uh, whatever they just suggest okay whatever they uh, ask us to do they will uh, you know we can do over here like this it's like a real time environment okay so you can uh, do uh, you know whatever uh, you know they suggested okay as per the business requirement or what it may be okay you can do so after uh, you know checking after completion of this uh, whole review right now what else you can do means okay so just go back to here all right go back to here now you will be having this as uh, done or fix what it means okay so as soon as you uh, just uh, you know click on this done right now what will happen now it will turn uh, into green color all right so yeah so let's make this yes perfect let's make this done and uh, let's make this refresh perfect now what else we can do means in the activity this has been converted into green color so that means this has been uh, accepted by the code reviewer okay now let's switch back to this our main let's refresh perfect now we got into green color all right let's refresh this app explorer as well okay now go back to this yeah now go back to this code with our now perfect yes so this is the only one rule which we have uh, you know <clears throat> created uh, under day underscore cwr now you can go ahead and now you can uh, you know merge this uh, into this applic main application or as per business standards whatever okay so this is how uh, you know about how we can uh, make it as a you know code reviewer uh, with the help of two operators id okay so with this you can very well relate it to this uh, you know real time environment how the real time environment works and everything okay so i also strongly suggest right so whatever the comments they have provided and whatever the rule you just you know developed right so uh, you need to make uh, a, a, a you know a clear and clear cut you know design document okay you need to articulate all those things so that you know it will be very easy right so it's always a better uh, you know to have a communication within the emails and as well as this portal as well like you know in the dev studio right so yeah so this all about today's uh, you know uh, poc so if you like our video uh, please like comment as and well share and also please do subscribe to our channel and if you want to <clears throat> more like this kind of videos right so please uh, comment uh, so that you know i can uh, prepare a more poc like this all right yeah thanks for your time and thanks for your patience bye bye